So like off stream, I kind of like did do some things just to see like, you know, why in my current location, I just kind of wanted to see like, you know, um, what can I do? What would I have right now? And really not much. Not much to be honest. Like literally not that much. Cause I mean to tell you the truth, like basically the only thing I kinda did was that I went ahead <clears throat> I already went ahead and, like unlocked like at least uh I know I unlocked this one here. And this one I unlocked like today, which is the air slam. And from looking at the way the video is, it looks great. And I mean it too. It looks like it's gonna help me out. Not to mention, like, you know, I did so many stuff I have to save up too. Like I definitely might want to like get this one next. But that's basically the game plan, you know, just so you know, get all that stuff. And, uh, anyways, let's go ahead and continue on. So right now we have to head for the Forgotten Forest. But yeah, I'm like really digging the, like the game too, to be honest. And also, I did check out the. Uh, re the well, technically, I didn't like see like much, but just like bits and pieces of like the reviews they put, like you know, games by IGN. And so far, like from what I've seen, like I just kind of like, like saw like a bit of the beginning, and I skipped all the way to the end to like you know see the score because I don't want to get spoiled by anything. But. Uh, yeah, GameSpot gave this game a 9, which is good. And IGN gave like an 8, which is, well, you know, it's like pretty okay, but I mean like, GameSpot gave this game a 9? Wow, <laughs> pretty something though. I mean, I can't say, like, you know, like, this would be, like, you know, like, game of the year to be, I mean, not right now at the moment, but this is technically Ember Labs, like, first game, and so far, like, people are, like, liking it, and they are getting positive reviews, like, I'm not lying, they are really getting, like, positive reviews from, like, uh, gaming companies. Could buy any. No, not yet. Okay, so I gotta go to that yellow spot. And I can't go up there. Oh, I think I'm supposed to shoot those things. Yep. Maybe. Oh, I guess I can. Okay, so I can't get through there. Where am I supposed to go? Like all three relics is summon Taro. Well, I got one. 
I need to find the other three. I mean, sorry, the other two. Jarrah, I'm not gonna lie. Off stream, I, I managed to glitch the game. Like, I was like exploring, like trying to find like, you know, some rods and like all of a sudden, like I was in a house and I had to know what I did, but all of a sudden, like, I, I pushed some things on the controller, right? Like, you, hitting this and hitting that, right? And all of a sudden, like, I was stuck, like, in first person mode, like, literally no joke. And like, when I was like, moving around, it's like, dude, the camera's fucking spinning. I didn't get dizzy from it, but I mean, it was like, spinning around, like, what the hell? And it's like, I couldn't even move. I tried moving the control stick and like moving the left stick, right stick, not if it worked. The only thing that kind of like helped me out was like the bow and arrow. So what I did was like in order to fix up like the glitch, what I did was I just went ahead and did this and I couldn't actually like move the right, but I can move the left. So all I had to do was just like jump, you know? And then go to like a warp stone and warp to like a place and then hopefully it fixes it. I mean it did fix it, but all of a sudden like, I kept seeing like this yellow spot. Like literally, that's all I seen was like this yellow spot. I mean it wasn't like bothersome or anything. Um Oh I gotta go that way. I still don't know like why it does that for. It's like I can't like warp. It says like you know I'm too too far away. I mean I am close to it, so I don't I don't know like you know what kind of that, what that means to be honest. And I really mean too. I don't know what the hell that means. <sighs> okay, I'm here. I'm supposed to do this. Okay, all this like bad stuff. Red bow, okay. I know it's telling me to go here, but how do I get there, to be honest? Or unless... Um... This is a wild guess, but even though, like, I went through some things, I still can't, like, I can't actually, like, you know, progress in the village. I did find a spirit mail, but I don't know where that goes. Uh, I might have to, so. It says me Resu in the Forgotten Forest, but the thing is, like, how do I get to the Forgotten Forest? I mean, technically, like, the way there is blocked off, so I can't get in. So I'll probably head back to village. Excuse me.
that ain't gonna work. Unless I find that thing. Does that mean the only way I'm gonna be able to progress is by like, you know, I destroy that thing. Now let me talk to this dude over here. Let me see if he's got anything to say. Actually, he's not here. Okay, and thought it'd be here, but I guess not. Hmm. I can't go that way because that's blocked off. It's this one here, okay. All right, some progress. There's a spirit. And the spirit finds peace. Let me some treasure. More of these crystals. Hmm, I guess that's it. Oh, hold on. There's something over here. There's a log. Nice, we found another one. I got a long way to go. Hmm. So I know the mess is telling me to go over there, but the thing is, what do I do? I mean, I can try to get to the village, but the time I even get there, like, it'll already be too late. I run out. And technically, she can't jump. See, she jumps and the thing breaks. Good, I probably won't even Oh wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Instead of going that way, what if I just do this here? What if I just do this here? I'm using the brain. My my thinky thing, chat room. I'm I'm using it. I know what to do. Hopefully this works. And if not then it's about square one. Only well, gotta make sure I just don't get stuck. And I don't go like too far away.
it don't. Well, I'll be. It don't work. Thought it would. And we have a glitch. This is what I was talking about, chat room. This is what I was literally talking about. I think because I hold like left and then hold circle. Yeah, it is wigging out. And the only way to fix this is like go to a war point. That's the only way to fix that is to go to a war point. And the game corrects itself. But I'm pretty sure since I've done that little bug. Um, well, bug or glitch or whatever you call it. I might see that yellow spot. But that right there is what I meant. At least the good thing is, I mean, shows like the waypoint. Now it's gone. Okay, I have to really figure out, man, how do I get over there? Oh, oh my god, are you serious? I should have looked around. God damn, I just wasted some time. I wasted a lot of time. Okay, now we made it to the Forgotten Forest. I didn't, I didn't see. No I didn't see. Jeez. Give me a break, chat room. The people who built them have long been forgotten, but their work still remains. Watching over the forest like ancient guardians, Taro's spirit has corrupted the shrines and sealed the entrance to the guardian tree. I can feel Taro's presence there. I've marked the shrine locations on your map. Thank you, Rusu. I'll work to clean the shrines. Taro often came with me to care for the shrines. Short ancient shrines open the guardian tree. trees that grow here. I've marked the shrine locations on your map. Okay. Um, I have to have to find a shrine mail here. Because I know one of them said, like, I'll meet you in the Forgotten Forest. So... We have to restore the water, fishing, wads, and the god tree shrine. Taro's love is right there, so that's locked up. Okay. Okay, now we're fishing making some progress now. Looks like we're gonna be heading for a battle. Hell 
There we go. Okay, there's probably more. Yep. Oh, good lord, that's not good. myself bind them with the rods but damn I like literally like headshot them Whew. I guess you said that one was a close call almost died snow from the mountain shrine feeds these streams. The waters here are sacred. What's that? Okay, there's a symbol. Bow spear. Something shiny over there. There's a treasure chest over there. Logo chest over there. Yeah. Hmm. Guessing it's a little shooting mini game. charged there we go oh sweet another one Doubt I can actually reach up there. I mean, she'll slide right off. Oh, that's the one that's locked off. So I can't go there yet until probably accomplish something or finish whatever I need to be done. Get that. Okay, um, oh, we can hit for the water shrine. Ew. Let's go ahead and climb this tree. Well, I hit that, but I need to find a way to get up there. Oh, <laughs> that's right. I gotta remind myself, like, look around. Look around for any progress or anything. I have to keep reminding myself that shit. Cause I mean, that's how it is playing, you know, these type of games. It's like, 
one minute, like, you know, you're progressing, the next minute, like, you're kind of stuck, and you don't know where to go. It does kind of suck, though, until all of a sudden you find out, like, oh, okay, I was actually supposed to look at this, or, like, get this, and then I can move on. Mm, it's kind of very common for like these type of games God damn they must be hungry well, there's two more Over there. They must really love that fruit right there. Okay, now we're going over there. <laughs> I know, damn, we're in for a big battle over there. God tree shrine. Oh, damn. Oh, shut up over there. Oh, God, there's another one over there. bad. Holy crap, I was getting fucking hurt. Whoa, game. Okay. Whoa, game. Are you okay? Holy crap. Oh, I see what's going on. Because I got killed, the game thinks... Ah, okay. That was pretty weird, I gotta say. And I got pushed off. I'm not gonna lie, this might be tough. I didn't get like a headshot in, I should be okay. How long you been up there? Pff, have a nice fall. Whew. 
Well, that's down. No more bad rent stuff. Some believe the shrines represent guardians of the forest from up here. It's easy to imagine them watching over the land. I guess I can't do anything yet because I need to like uh, free up the other shrines. Hmm. Going. Oh wow, that took a while. Really wish I could leave them there, but they don't want to. Oop, hold on. Yep, wait a minute. Hmm. Where do you go? Okay, that's Taro's love, but like you said, I need to free up the shrines. There you go. Now they're happy. They're gonna get it or what? Ah, there's more over there. <sighs> A cursed chest. Be all enemies before time runs out. Oh boy. I only have one enemy left and time ran out. God damn it, let's do it, cool. This is going to be complicated.
damn it, why'd you back up? God damn it, he had a bunch, he had like a little bit of health up and he had a back up like an idiot. Okay, I think I know what I have to do. I might have to, like, shoot him with my arrows. Slow down time, shoot him with the arrows while he's bounded. And then, hopefully, like, dealing some damage. Gotta wait for my health to come back. Okay, me getting this chance better be damn worth it. Oh, come on, I'm parrying that shit. Almost. Wish you didn't hit me at the end. Almost. Mm. Man, his regeneration needs to be a little bit quick. Let's go, we got it. Better be worth it. A 
All that for a hat. All that work for a hat. Okay. Alright, game. Alright, I ain't mad. I mean, I like, a, I like a good challenge. I mean, hell. Like, off stream, I forgot to mention this. Like, I did, like, another challenge where it's like, I'm supposed to defeat four enemies without getting hit once. It seemed like a little bit of a challenge, but I mean, phew. well, I guess I did it, but you know what? Whatever. I mean, it was a bit of a challenge, but hell, at least I did it. Uh, okay, where does this go? Aha! Uh -huh. Whoop! <laughs> Didn't even mean to get in the way. Maybe it's supposed to come over here? I place it over here. And then Oh wait 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 I see another one over there. I see another one over there. Yeah, yeah, okay, we put place it right over here. Then they drop it. And then I can do the thing. Hopefully it works. And it worked! Hey! hey. These shrines were built on places of power. Their stones are buried deep, connected to the flow of energy beneath the ground. Energy! Hmm. Oh, there's another thing over there. Nice, it's a war point. I'm guessing it goes right here. Okay, drop it. Okay, never mind. That was kind of a waste. Or wait a minute, hold the phone. Now there's nothing there. See what's over here real quick. Well, still don't hurt to check it out. Cool. Ah man. Is that? Oh, it's a meditation one. Cool. Sweet.
I'm like literally finding so many rods today. But I mean, I still got a long way to go. I need 12 more. Okay, I guess that's it for this area here. Okay, we need to go over there now. No, we can't go there yet. Not gonna know where this thing goes to be honest. Right there. Hmm. I really don't know to be honest. Here. Right. We got all the owls over there. And I mean to do that. I don't know what's gonna do when I get like well the three statues. I found two, but <laughs> I don't know where the third one is at. Alright, place right here, boys. Nice and easy. Gently. There you go. Alright, cool. I got a 165. Let's go get this second one. And uh, pick this up here. It is kind of very surprising that even though these things are kind of small, they are still able to actually lift up a statue. That's like maybe maybe like heavier than them. Don't even ask me how like you know how much that damn thing weighs. Okay, uh, let's go find a third one. Oh wow, <laughs> just went back and to the rent things again. Hmm. Yeah. Excuse me. I definitely gonna make that up for sure. I don't think I went over here. Oh no, I didn't. Let's go buy him some things. I got an acorn hat. Still kind of funny though how to get a party hat. Oh man.
Slide on. That's a bad. And yeah, nothing. I think if I go ahead and like get rid of the leaves, I could find something. Okay, I found nothing. Over there. Okay, so what the, in the Sam Hill is supposed to do with this thing here? This man's supposed to put over here. What if I just do this? Can I? Oh, that's a no. Wait a minute. Ah, damn it, stupid invisible wall. Let's go ahead and get over that. Get over there and, uh, you know, rip that shrine or something. Did that? I uh, could get rid of this, like, you know, icky red stuff. Hmm. Several worn fishing baskets here. A simple design, but effective. Whoa. Fishing.
Okay. So I'm guessing, do I have to hit him in like a certain order or what? Okay, that did something. At least some enemies! Okay. Oh, probably because I'm like, doing it wrong or something. Hmm. So I think I am supposed to hit him in a certain order. Pretty sure that like if I keep like you know doing this like wrong enemies are gonna spawn and I have to do it like right so what if I just do it wait What if I do this? No. Okay, so I think I have to hear the sound. Surprised they don't attack. All right. Hey, we got it right, cool. All right. We <laughs> know, like, we know how to find out what was the order. The children in Taro often fished in these streams in the stillness of the forest. I can almost hear their voices. Taro and his siblings got safe in these woods. You taught them well, Ritu. All right, well, that's done. Let's go to Taro's Love now. Oh, wow. <laughs> what a coincidence. <laughs> Another rot. I mean, like, drop some fruit or something. There's the other owl. Yo. Oh, 
Okay, so now that the shrines are done, what I'm gonna do now is just head over there. I should probably like, see if I can get some like upgrades. It's kind of like they don't mind. They love doing this. And we get a deer hat. So 265. Hmm. I think this might help out, so I might get this. Oh boy, got it a uh, boss. I don't know why my lock on like disappeared. God damn. Let me get the hell up, jeez. game I'm hitting lock on and you're not locking on why boys oh yeah oh this is perfect this is so damn perfect the stupid monster <laughs> literally just put me up on this rock right here and could not even attack me wow actually can i actually oh wow i can actually wow okay i mean that's pretty good i mean like literally the monster didn't even attack me i mean i was thinking like well i didn't know i can actually get up there like if i knew this shit right here like just get up here and the monster won't leave a won't attack and then you can just like keep like you know shooting your arrows over and over and over until it is gone oh, god wow that's an that is like a great exploit an easy way on being that boss a great great exploit that just somehow by some sheer luck well instant i killed the boss no problems at all
second relic. We leave offerings at the Guardian Tree, asking it to protect the ones we love. Taro left this for the children. He must have been so scared when he lost them. Many of the offerings here were placed by the first village leaders, skilled hunters who use spirit energy to create powerful weapons. I'm sure the Guardian Tree won't mind if we use them to help Taro. Food offering. You know, I thought it kind of looked like some kind of book or something. Taro's regret. Clear the corruption in the Lantern Cave. I guess that seems like a good place to like, explore. See what's up. I think the only thing I have a little gripe is like you know, I'm hitting like, you know, R3 and, and it's not like, you know, doing a thing. Getting close, close, stopped it. I don't know what corruption waits for you in the Lantern Cave, but I suspect Taro's spirit will fight to the end. Cool. Okay. Oh, going that way is a no go.
rock had car A fox symbol is marked on this old camping gear. More of memories. Something must have done him in. Should probably save to get this right here. for that. Yeah. Mm. Mm. Gotta get rid of this stuff here. Not do nothing. You know, it would be kind of cool if somehow they had like, um, like hats from like, uh, other Sony games too. But I'm pretty sure they probably needed like, you know, like permission from like the other developers. Like, hey, we want to know if we can like, you know, use a character's design as a hat for upcoming game. And I'm pretty sure they'd be like, sure, why not? Excuse me. Hmm. Like I said, it would be nice, but I need permission. I don't know, maybe like Ratchet's hat, uh, Jack's goggles, or I don't know who else to be honest. I mean, it can't be like, you know, Kratos, that for sure. Ooh, a Sackboy hat. That would be good. About like a maybe a crash bandicoot hat or a spiral hat. I mean, I don't know, it'd be, it'd be kind of cool, you know. I mean, if you kind of like, you know, take a look, like, 
if you kind of like you know take a look chat room like if they if they can like implement like you know something like you know like at least like you know like the the ears and then like you know his hair and then probably like, you know like the eyebrows I'm pretty sure like you know it would definitely be you know good I mean it might be challenging but be good and uh so here and then for like spiral well the only thing that could probably do is well technically well just like have only this right here you know only the two horns and then this right here and then that'd be it I mean it could be done because I mean people like you know I'm pretty sure people like you know be somewhat like surprised like oh crap they actually like you know putting like a character from this game as like an easter egg that's pretty cool I mean come on take a look at Ghost of Tsushima like the Iki Island expansion that game had like really great like easter egg armors too I mean not to mention like um like when I was like going around about like playing that game like I was exploring I stumbled upon like a waterfall and there was a cave behind the waterfall I went in and then you know I found some like words on the wall and then I turned and it was a mask and they turned again and there was like a picture of a hippo a raccoon and then a turtle and my brain was like processing like holy crap that's the Sly those are that's from Sly Cooper and I was like so damn surprised like wow literally a Sly Cooper Easter egg in Ghost of Tsushima which was pretty cool and then well they also had like a God of War reference and then they had a Horizon Zero Dawn uh, Easter egg in there too but technically uh, the Aloy costume is only for like the female but that's only in Legends and then they had the um, the character from Shadow of the Colossus and then Jarnum's like what I mean sorry armor in the game too which is what technically from Bloodborne so you know what I mean I'm not gonna lie I mean it's 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 pretty cool for like you know these developers to actually like you know like put in like these easter eggs from like these Sony games that we like played and then they put them in like well their likenesses like either like you know their clothing costume hats whatever you know into the game I mean well technically Fall Guys is like you know does the same thing too I mean hell there's like a challenge well technically it's not like a challenge going on actually ch there is a challenge going on in Fall Guys which is basically you just gotta do some things during like the whole squad show where you got to do like team base and it's basically just for the um, I think it was like what mid fall holiday something I don't know actually I think it's like a Google or something yeah the beginning of fall so I don't know mid mid autumn something but uh yeah you know it's oh I am way off I gotta go over here but it's pretty something though because um, today they have the challenge and then also they even announce that um, they are going to actually put in the costumes from this game here into Fall Guys. And it's not bad. I mean, like I said, it's pretty cool. But as I said before, in order for them to actually do something like this, they need to get permission from like the developers of like this game to say like, we want to use your character, not like you know like the character in our game, but you know like use a character as a costume or maybe like you know like the whole like the characters like you know like uh face as like a logo for upcoming game or like decal or like whatever or like for an easter egg and once they give like the thumbs up like yes you can you can use our character in your game as an easter egg or a costume or an icon or anything like that that's like the only way you're gonna get permission or actually I'm sorry to say this but that's the only way you're gonna get like you know like 
these Easter eggs are like this character design logo whatever you're gonna put into the game you just gotta get permission from them they say okay it's a it's a good it's good to go might be a little bit of a pain but if they can like you know work their magic I mean basically they can actually get the character like no problem at all Yeah, it's supposed to go that way. It went the wrong way. Probably just swim. Oh, I almost walked up the damn cliff. I have no idea what to do. Crystal. Oh, it's right there. Thank you for right there, Grand Soul. Themselves off the cliff. <laughs> Holy crap, she was walking on here for like at least a second. Sure is like where are you going? Just to make sure like everything stays in the green. I stay in the green.
Um, I don't know why you guys would run away. I need your help. God, these stupid sticks only take one hit. That'll do. Wait, how many? Oh, cool, I can upgrade. Sweet. Now I don't have to worry about this shit. Now I can, like, go ahead and, like, have one in the battle. Alright, um. I don't think I need to do this anymore, so let's just go down here. Oh, no, 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 wait, this is this. Hurry, I want to. Oh, sliding on. Bumping around. Spooky cave. Oh yeah, we're heading for a boss battle. Let's get ready. I'm gonna face some probably annoying monster with some other monsters. Got a big guy here. Shrine Guardian. Yep, what I just say. summons them back.
God damn it. Took one down. How did that miss? I'm kind of like playing it safe right now. I don't want to get too close. Well, at least I didn't do that much damage. Got him. He's gone. Down goes the beast. Ooh. This that must be the last one. Free Taro, use the relics to free Taro. Cool. Man turn. Oh, I need four more. Shoot. I need four more and I level up. Let's get the hell out of here. Playing like slow and easy has its reports. Well, I'm just saying, like, you know, 
play it safe, then it's slow, but it has its rewards. But the thing is, you don't want to be too creepy. That's the problem. It's like you want to beat the boss like super quick, or like, you know, you're powerful, you have all this ability and all this gear and stuff, and like you're thinking, okay, I can take this boss on no problem at all. But the thing is, it's like, don't get too greedy. Yes, we. Oh, we put it over there. Oh, okay. Wow, these are buzzer quick. Do we? Okay, I can't place it over there because there's a log. Oh, it's for this thing. I guess I have to follow his path. This might be a new area. Just ran right into that damn thing. I didn't see it. Yeah. Black skies are gonna oh, clear up. Water. Put on a happy face. Or was it dark skies are gonna clear up? Okay, now we can head over here. Ooh, treasure. Pinecone hat. Not gonna lie, playing more of this game is like basically. I am noticing like you know some uh, glitches in this game. Not gonna lie, there is some glitches in this game. But like, if a glitch happens to you, like when you're battling, you're facing like an annoying like big boss monster, and um, kind of like you know like what happened to me, you know. I mean, I was facing like a damn monster like right over here in this area and then all of a sudden he hit me Led me and landed like, you know, top on this damn rock and all of a sudden he didn't even like bother to attack me Stood right there like a dummy and Saying like, oh, you're up there. So I can't attack you. So go ahead and hit me with some free hits Wham 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 I win Literally, it's like a goddamn exploit but the thing is, is like, uh, you can actually go up there. I mean, too. You're gonna go go up them damn rocks. Just jump up and he won't attack you. I mean... 
I mean, you can exploit, but you have to make sure it's like a close range monster. But if it's like a long range monster, you might have trouble. <laughs> oh, you might have the trouble. In. <sighs> Excuse me. I'm going to help Taro now, but it's not safe for you here. Go with Mr. Rusu. I'll find you when Taro is free. Be careful, Kane. I guess we did that and we're gonna have to face like what, some big giant monster? I didn't think that for this thing right here, it helps. Can't get any upgrades no more. Got 
I gotta really use my shield more, man. Where are you at? This motherfucker backed up, changing his trajectory in mid-air. Come on. I really gotta know is patterns, man. Patterns. Hey, Saxon, man, what's up? <laughs> well, yeah, animation. Okay, okay, this thing has some moves. I 
I dodged that, come on. Standing outside smoking, hopefully it's a good smoke. <laughs> Like, you know, hopefully the brand you're smoking is like, you know, good. No, because I don't smoke. I roll? Oh my god, literally, I fucking rolled right out of the damn way. Come on. Is smoking since about 11? Yeah, right. No way. No way someone's been smoking since they were 11.
down you go. Yeah, no way. I still don't believe you. It's like maybe one like one of your uncles like you know like just get you a hey, son or like nephew I let me teach y'all about the way to smoke it I'm just taking a shot in the dark here I need to shoot the lantern when he's charging at me. And he fucking cobbled me to death. Not even like get up or any invincibility. Just cobble me to death. Here's the good thing is I can skip this. I shook her head yes when she heard you say no way. Oh wow. Hey, I was just I was just guessing. I technically did not mean to do that. Cigarettes were really easy to steal back then before you started locking them up by putting them behind the counter. Mm. I mean, technically if I remember that shit, I was like back in the 90s. I don't know who like does that now, but I think 7-Eleven like, you know, like they still have them out in the open. You gotta get them behind the counter. Excuse me. Ow. Get one around there.
Gotcha. Let's go! Corruption gone. <laughs> Trying to use the right. That was pretty something, but we did it. Whew. In three years, I've been smoking it for about 30 years. Really, man. I mean, <laughs> must be some kind of like record or something. All right, let's enjoy the cinematic. The sickness that took our parents was spreading through the village. Spirits of the forest, walk with our people. Guide them on their journey to the mountain shrine. Food was running low. Everyone was scared. I never felt so helpless. Saya wanted to stay, but I thought we could go to Rusu for help. I was sure he would know what to do. Something was not right in the woods. I had never seen Rusu so worried. He sent us back to the village. And I knew we were alone. I was all that Benny and Saya had left. I had to protect them. happened the next morning. explosion from the mountain shrine covered the land in darkness.
Damn it, I'm loving like, you know, the cinematic cutscenes. I know like a lot of people are saying this, it, it is very like, you know, like watching a Pixar movie. for days. I searched everywhere for them. I was their older brother. I was supposed to protect them. Even now, it's hard to forgive myself. Taro, the children know how much you care for them. What happened in the village wasn't your fault. You will always be their older brother, and they still need you. I'm sorry, Kimio. They can't take you to the mountain shrine. It's okay. You have to go now. Turn to the mass shrine to honor Taro. Yeah, right had it built. So will this take me? Oh, I can meditate. Sweet health boost. I'll say it once. And I'll say it again. I really love the transi the transition from like cinematics to like in in game. I I love that shit so much. I just love it how it transitions from like cinematics to like in game. It's so fucking cool and good. All right, let's head back over here now. I'm kind of loving this game. I am kind of am. I mean, I really am. I basically, it's like story-wise, it's pretty good. Graphic-wise, it's like great-looking. Transition from cinematic cutscene to in-game, it's pretty great. So, I mean, yeah, it's 
for Emerald Labs, like, first, like, you know, game developing this, even though, like, from what we all know, it was supposed to be released last August, but technically they said that they wanted to, um, they kind of wanted to, like, delay the game for, like, at least a month so they could polish up more. And you know what? It, it, it's, I say it's a pretty good idea they did that shit. So I'm pretty sure if they wouldn't like release it the way they, they were going to release it back in August. I mean, people would have like, you know, like mix, you know, mix like, eh, you know, they should have done like more work or there's like some things they should have like done here in this area or like done some more work in here or like, uh, like characters animation or something like that. So it's a pretty good idea. For like a gaming company to delay a game, even though it might take a long time, depending on long, how long they need for us to wait for the game to be done, and depends how like long the polishing they need on the game to develop, then it's like it's worth it, you know. You don't want them to release a bad game, you know, and have like real bad and shit. To be honest, Taro rests with his siblings now. I imagine the corruption in the forest has cleared as well. I know it was time for Benny and Saya to move on with their brother, but... But it's understandable if they do that. It's natural to build a connection with the spirits we help. We give up a part of ourselves when they move on. But the bond still remains. The path of a spirit guide is a lonely one. There is still work to be done if you wish to reach the mountain shrine. A skilled woodsmith once lived in our village and built structures beyond anyone's imagination. Search the fields beyond the storehouse for her troubled spirit. Adia's uh, mask. Or Adira's mask, if I already pronounce it. Alright, so, Taro's spirit is now done. So now we have to help, you know, a woodsmith. But that is going to have to wait because chat room, I'm going to go save the game. Why is it not saving? There it goes. Okay, cool. So nice chat room, that's going to be it for me for tonight because I am going to call it a night. I, but I will be back playing more of this game tomorrow. So y'all, can't wait to play more of this game.